Hi, coaches. My name is Dr. Stephanie Burgos, and I wanted to welcome you to your Coach Basics. I am so excited that you have decided to become a coach. My name is, again, Dr. Stephanie Burgos, and I have been a coach since July of 2013. In 2015, I was an elite coach, and my team ranked in the top 85 in the company. So you're in good hands, and again, I'm so excited to get you started. So what I wanted to do is just kind of set the expectations for the week ahead. This group will only be seven days. And so every single day, you're going to see a post. And at the bottom of the post, there's going to be an assignment for that day. Myself and Nina and others who have contributed to this training have really tried to condense what we think is the most basic things that you absolutely need to learn in the first week of coaching. Trust me, anything that we are giving you in this week, it's not something extra or something we think you may need. It's absolutely something that we know is necessary for you to have success in your business. So a couple things. I want you to know that it is very normal to feel overwhelmed as a new coach. I actually expect it a lot of times. There's a lot of information for you to learn over the course of this, per this first week, as well as the next month, two months, three months. And honestly, I've been a coach for over 30 months now, and I'm still learning. The point, though, is that you do something every single day that moves your business forward. So speaking of that, what I wanted to talk to you about today are the three vital behaviors, the three fundamentals that we do as coaches that are absolutely necessary for you to move your business forward. Whether I'm working a busy day in the ER or whether I'm off or whether I'm on vacation or whether I'm helping someone who's sick or whether I'm sick, I absolutely get these three vital behaviors done. What I want you to think about is imagine if you had a storefront. Imagine if you had to go and physically open up a store in order for your business to work. You know, right now you're, what you're doing is you're creating an at-home business. And so there's no actual store that you need to go and open up. But the idea is that you need to show up every single day. And every single day is basically showing up with the three vital behaviors. So the first one, number one, is doing your workout, which is awesome because at the end of the day, a lot of you are just starting your journey or maybe still have a lot of weight that you need to lose, or maybe you have a couple, you know, just the last, the those last few pounds. It doesn't matter where you are. I'm so excited for you. And what I want you to understand that it's actually now your job to work out. So that was something that I found really awesome about being a coach. I found it extremely motivating in my own journey as I'm still going through my journey, but especially when I started. When I started as a coach, I needed to lose about 15 pounds when I started. And so I was so excited just to kind of have that extra accountability. So the first vital behavior is doing your workout and drinking your Shakeology every single day. This vital behavior is called being proof that the product works. This is really important so that, you know, at the end of the day, we never want you to feel like you are selling something. We want you to feel like you are sharing something that you absolutely love. So if you're not using it, if you're not loving it, then you need to talk to your sponsor coach and say, you know what, I don't know if this is for me. Because again, like I said, I never want you to feel like you're selling something. I want you to feel like you're sharing something. Number two of the vital behaviors is your personal development. This is really, really important. At the end of the day, we all come in with weaknesses. We all come in with, you know, our past struggles in our past. And if we want to be successful entrepreneurs, if we want to have a successful business, we need to make sure that first our mind is right, you know? And so personal development is basically taking about 10 to 15 minutes every single day to listen to some sort of audio book or to read a book that's going to help you with skills and a mindset that's going to help you prevail over the course of being an entrepreneur. There are a lot of ups and downs, and there are going to be a lot of things you're not going to understand, you're not going to learn, and the key is that you need to be willing to push through and fail forward and always be trying and doing your best. And you have to have, number one, belief in yourself, and number two, vision of where you see yourself and where you want this business to go. And personal development will help you with that. So that's the second vital behavior. 
Number three is inviting. We call it invite, invite, invite. And the idea is that every single day we should be talking about what we're doing and inviting other people to join in on their journey with us. And that could be in the form of a post. It can be in the form of actually reaching out to people and sharing with them what you're doing. It could be in the form of reaching out to people and inviting them to join your challenge group, um, which is basically how we invite people into joining us and to um, getting and to help them get started with their with their fitness journey. And so that is a absolute you know, vital behavior because at the end of the day, our goal every single day is to reach out to three to five people and just start a conversation. We really want to know where they are in their journey. We really want to help them get healthy, help them get started. And we want to be able to get to know where they are, what they have done in the past, what are their needs so that we can match them up with the proper program. So inviting, talking to people, building relationships is the third vital behavior. So every single day, no matter what, so when you're busy and you're saying, oh my goodness, I have no time, at the very least, I need you to focus on the three vital behaviors. I know that when I was very busy, working 12 to 15 hour days sometimes, I would at least, at the end of the day, I would at least focus on the three vital behaviors. Anything else, I would leave for another day, but I at least stuck always with those vital behaviors. The second thing I wanted to really talk to you about today are basically setting the expectation of what we hope will be a goal for you for this month, um, your first month as a coach, as well as for this week. And so every month as, you know, every month basically as a coach, our goal is to hit Success Club 5. So you may ask, what is Success Club? Success Club is basically a benchmark that we use to make sure that we are moving our business forward. It means that we are adding people to our clientele we are helping people you know get started with one of our programs with one of the packages that we sell and it means that we're growing our business and so every month our goal is success club five the way that you get success club five is that for every challenge pack that you sell you get two success club points so if you think about it that means you should aim to sell at least three challenge packs a month a challenge pack is basically a program with 30 days of Shakeology. That package, that value, that is basically a full complete package so that someone can get started properly on their healthy journey. So success club, the three vital behaviors, and then last but not least, your first rank advancement as a new coach will be emerald rank. Emerald rank means that you have basically inspired and motivated someone with your motivation, with your story, with how excited you are to become a coach as well and to join us in this community. You know, I tell a lot of new coaches that at the end of the day, we are nothing but a positive and uplifting community. Think about all the people around you who could benefit from being around positive and supportive people. And so that is something that I want you to be keeping in mind so that you're not afraid in terms of reaching out to people about becoming a coach because at the end of the day, at the very least, they're going to be joining a very positive and supportive community. So Emerald Rank is the third thing I wanted to discuss. And again, that is basically uh, having two coaches who sign up under you. So Again, this week is going to be a lot of information. Every day, there's going to be a topic. There's going to be assignments. I want you to check in, commit to checking in every single day. I don't care what time you check in, but just check in every single day and make sure you do the assignments. Again, all the things that are in here, we put them in there because we genuinely think and believe that these are core things that you need to understand. So I am very, very, very excited that you have joined us and I cannot wait to see what happens. All right, take care. Bye.